that day for Ohio State just because they were five and four-star kids. Obviously, it's taken them some years to get to this point. When you get to this point and make two of the biggest defensive stops in the game together as best friends, like is that something special? Is that something yeah, you recognize? It, it, like, to me, it says everything about what this program and what those kids are all about. It's, you know, those two are really solid players. And like Justin, for example, has just fought back from injury, fought back from injury, worked, never gave up. At times he probably could have. And then he probably has the biggest play of the game today on that interception. Like, you can't say as a coach how, how proud you are of that. Because that exemplifies you. Everybody looks at the superstars, right? Today was his day. And, and it, that's what college football is all about. That's what life's all about. His work, his perseverance. And then he comes up with that play. Are you kidding me? He'll remember that for the rest of his life and so will everybody here. So I'm just really proud of him. When you are in a situation where you have different linebackers and pieces to play with, how do you make the decision? Like, why is he on the field at that point? And, and yeah, like to no, be in that, that position. Good question. It's who do they have on the field? What personnel? What person? What do we think they're going to run? So it's just okay. We're trying to match what they're doing. Because it was big just for him to be out there to that's begin right. with. That's right. Yeah. So just proud of him, man. It's awesome. I'm glad you asked that question because that needs to be talked about. So I appreciate that. Thank what you. did you know about Ohio State, Michigan, before you got hired here? I watched it in a hotel room. Every year, I rooted for Coach Day in every one of those games, him and Coach Ciano. Um, knew it was one of the biggest rivalries in all of sports. Um, I never knew how big it was. No idea, none. The day I got here, I learned what it was all about. What is it that, that makes it land that like, oh, now I kind of get this now? Well, to me, it's it's part of our culture. That's, that's the game. That's, you don't wear blue in our office. You don't say the word. Um, you have you have periods against them. You have things dedicated to them. Um, that's the game. You you've been lots of places where that team has a rival. Has anything in no. your past? I've never seen rival? anything. No. This is this is it. I'd be I'd love to see one bigger in all sports. Seriously. I mean, you can say there are. But I'd like to see one. What did you learn from What did you learn from Al and Greg about the rivalry? Like, what have, you, what have they said about it? What have you learned from them? I really we haven't talked too much in detail. Just honestly, we'll, we'll I'll probably talk about that. You can ask me later in the week about that one. Are you gonna be out this week? What's that? Are you gonna be out this week? Can we talk to you this week? I'm, if, ask Jerry. Who really answers that? I never know my schedules. <laughs> hey, coach. What uh, What was uh, your uh, message to the seniors, um, other, especially the defensive seniors that uh, that were leaving? Uh, if you could just kind yeah, of the the, the message from the back. beginning of the week we weren't gonna we weren't gonna let we weren't gonna lose this game for them. We were gonna win the game for them. There's no way we were gonna lose this game. We were not letting those seniors walk out of here. Their last game in the shoe, losers. No way. And that, that told the whole, we told the whole team that wasn't going to happen. There's no way that was going to happen. And didn't. Jeff, I don't know if you saw Ryan up here after the game. He was pretty fired up. You know? Yeah. And I, I asked him the question, did you learn something about your team today? Yeah, we definitely learned about the team today. And, and I said this earlier, there was a time when the momentum was about to swing in that game. And I'd be lying if I didn't say that. And we swung right back and we knocked him out. So that tells you all you need to know. You're, you're getting hit in the face, you're getting hit in the ribs, you're about to go down, and you stand up, and you fight back, and you come out on top. Hasn't had to happen all year. I'm glad it, I'm, I wish it could have been a little bit different, but I'm glad it happened, and I'm glad we won, and now you can learn from it. Because now you know what you have. You have a team that's not gonna quit, you have a team that's gonna fight, and that's special. We haven't seen it yet. Is there some 